Hello everybody, Garward Aviation here, back with another video. This is a very special video. Not only because it's the inaugural update of my EWR Model Airport, uh, but not only that, I have some special news related to my YouTube channel at the end of the video. But before we start the inaugural update, I just want to give you guys a little bit of uh, tour around my airport. Uh, so this is the um, main taxiway. It's a... Uh, basically just where all the aircraft taxi to this is a secondary one and then what aircraft will do is they'll come around here and they'll come into the stands and you can go around like that uh, so basically I have four wide body stands and seven narrow body stands uh, so I have a total of 11 stands uh, at this model airport now this isn't my um, actual model airport I'm currently working on uh, my main one, this one is sort of like a temporary-ish one, like, I'm still gonna have it after, I'm not gonna throw it out, but it's just gonna be one for emergencies, like, if I'm, uh, doing renovations on my board and I can't use the board. Uh, so yeah, now let's commence the airport update. Uh, so I have, uh, just one more thing before the update starts, I really do apologize, but I forgot to say it in my intro. Um, I currently do not have any 1-400, uh, GSE ground service equipment, uh, I apologize. Uh, I do plan on getting some in the future, uh, so look out for that. But for now, just the aircraft uh, on the airport will have to suffice. Starting off at the wide body gates, this is gate Sierra 1 S1. Uh, we have this United 777 300ER in the um, New Livery Blue Evolution Livery. Uh, he just came in from London Heathrow and will be heading back out there. Moving on to gate Sierra 2 S2 or the second wide body gate, we have this United 77-10 Dreamliner in the Continental Library. Uh, he's just getting loaded up for a flight out to Amsterdam uh, and previously he came in from LAX. Now I know this isn't uh, accurate, Ethiopian do operate a 77 Dreamliner um, to EWR. Uh, but I only have an Ethiopian 767-300, so this will have to suffice for now. Uh, but anyway, this is the Ethiopian 767-300ER in the Retro Library. He's getting loaded up for a flight out to Lome, uh, and he previously came in from there. Um, now I know this might not be that accurate, as SAS currently they're operating an A350, uh, but they are returning the A330 to service uh, in late October. Uh, so. At some points, uh, whenever you guys are watching this, uh, this might or might not be accurate. But uh, anyway, here we have an Scandinavian Airlines SAS 8030 300 in the old library. Uh, he's pushing back uh, out of the last wide body stand that is uh, stand S4 or C04. Uh, and he's preparing for a flight out to Copenhagen. Uh, now, he did come from Copenhagen last night and he spent the night here. Moving on to the first narrow body stand, that is stand uh, S5 or Sierra 5. We have this uh, United A319 in the uh, new library. He came in from Denver around 30 minutes ago and he is loading up passengers and he's going to head back out there. Moving on to the next narrow body gate, that is gate S6, Sierra 6. Uh, pushing out of uh, Sierra 6 or S6, uh, we have this. United uh, 757 200 in the Her Art Here California Library. Uh, he's pushing out of the gate and is preparing for a flight out to LAX. Next to him in gate S7 or CR7, we have this United Airlines E175. Uh, this is in the old Continental Library. Uh, he came in from Columbus and pretty soon he's going to be heading out to Key West. Moving on to the next narrow body gate, which is S8 or CR8. We have this United 737-800 in the uh, New Library slash Star Alliance Library. Uh, he came in from Houston and he is going to head back out there. Next to the United 738, we have this Delta, uh, former Delta MD-90 should I say, um, that is currently being operated by a private entity. Right now it is preparing for a charter flight out to Baltimore BWI. Uh, and before sitting at the stand for a few days, it came in from Tulsa or Red River Aviation Airport. Next to the Delta MD-90, we have this wonderful Spirit A321 in the Bananas Library. 
Uh, he came in from Fort Lauderdale and is preparing for a flight out to Atlanta. Next to the Spirit A321 in the Bananas Library, we have another Spirit A321 in the Bananas Library. Uh, it's the one on your left. Uh, he came in from Fort Lauderdale and he's heading back out there. And to conclude this update, we have this United 757-200 in the Herard here in New York, New Jersey Library. Uh, he left stand S6 or CR6 a half hour ago, and right now he's taxiing up to the runway for a flight to SFO. And that does conclude this update. And now for my channel news. Um, now, most of you guys know me as Adamic Avia on YouTube, but I changed my name because, honestly, it's a hard name to say and remember. Um... So I decided to change my name to Guard Aviation, um, just so that way it's easier for you guys to remember my YouTube channel name. And another thing, um, I'm going to be putting a poll on Instagram asking you guys whether I should do these updates uh, monthly or weekly. So comment down below um, what you guys want or if you guys have Instagram, um, go on to Instagram and do the poll and that does conclude this video if you guys like the video please like subscribe turn on the notification bell so you don't miss one of my videos and comment down below what you thought of the airport update and my new youtube channel name once again thank you for watching today's video and i'll see you in the next video as always goodbye